I am at the Animal Kingdom today. It looks like it's going to be a great day so far. It doesn't look like it's going to rain. The weather is nice. It's not too hot out today. And I'm here on a Wednesday, so I'll take a look at the crowds. All right, let's check out this park. Look how beautiful this park is. Look at this trail. Just love all these trails, although it's kind of easy to get lost here. And this is so different compared to all the other parks, you know, it's just so unique and it's just nice just to chill and take a walk and look around. I don't always even feel the need to just rush off to a ride or anything. Oh. Hi friends! Thank you for visiting us today. Just a few moments. Please stop and enjoy the slowly covering your nose and mouth. And be warned at all times. Accessible activity you need to your train while stationary. Hi guys! My friends, Adventure Calls! Look over at the Discovery River to Mickey and his pals sailing on their rare safari. Here is a beautiful sight with the tree of life. If you look at it really closely, there's carvings of animals everywhere in the tree. There's just so much detail to it. It's so pretty. It's also a very popular place to get a, a photo pass photo. <laughs> get that Instagram photo. Festival of the Lion King is closed right now, unfortunately. For the record, so is the Finding Nemo musical. I wonder when they're going to open back up again. It's just so sad to see it closed right now. Especially since the Festival of the Lion King is one of the best shows, honestly, that Disney has ever had. Hopefully it'll be safe enough again to open it up again soon. What's sad is uh, a lot of the performers I've seen in the festival of the Lion King and the Finding Nemo musical, I feel like I've seen for a lot of years now, like they've been pretty loyal to the shows and they've been performing in them for quite a while and it's just so sad to see them closed. I'd like to see all these performers go back to work. Well, it looks like there's another little character cavalcade I've seen at least this is the fourth one I've seen today. And it's out on the river, which is awesome. These are so cute and so good to see that they have a, a lot of different characters. I saw Chip and Dale and Rafiki. It's so awesome. Hi, Miko. I love you. Hey. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, look at these guys. They're so cute. Hey, friends. Hey, dude. Hey, friend. Thank you. 
It's the baby. So cute. Have the back side of water. Now we are in Pandora, the land of Avatar. This is really exciting because this is such a beautiful place. Look at all this, this is just unreal. And again, we have the backside of water. This is another area of the animal kingdom where the attention to detail is just magnificent. This is so pretty, I'm jealous. I wish they had this in California. The way you're going to do this is by being matched to something called an avatar. They're created by blending human DNA and Navi DNA. Once we match you to an avatar, thanks to a special link chair, your mind will be able to control that avatar. Using avatars to fly this way was all figured out by my boss, Dr. Jackie Ogden. She leads her science team, which is part of the Pandora Conservation Initiative, and we're here in the Valley of Moara studying banshees and their environment. So we just rode Flight of Passage. It said it was about a 45 minute wait. I would say we waited about 21 minutes. Um, I didn't film it out of respect for the ride. And anyway, I don't really want to give anything away because honestly, that ride is just like phenomenal. It's, it's so amazing. So yeah, Flight of Passage is one ride you do not want to miss if you come to the Animal Kingdom. The line is probably going to be the longest in the park, but it's just totally worth it. Let's have another look at this. This is a sight I have missed. One thing I'm kind of sad about is that you can't see Pandora at night anymore because the park closes at five. But it's just so beautiful here at night. Everything's all lit up. So that's definitely something I miss. So we have to go on the safari ride, of course. It says 10 minutes. What do you think, Mom? It's just going to be a walk-on. A walk-on? Um, yeah. <laughs> Animal Kingdom is basically ours. Yeah. So I'm going to say anything that has a bit of a weight, it's only because it's the most popular attraction. So. Right, right, um, right. Well, we'll see. Even still, with Flight of Passage, we never stopped. We didn't, right? No. Yeah, it was about 21 minutes, not so yeah. bad. Yep. Yeah. Now their horns actually point backwards to deter animals like lions jumping on the back of them. It looks like we're passing some Ann Coley cattle off to the left over here. Ooh. Now Ann Coley cattle actually are the only domesticated animal found out on the reserve. First domesticated by the Wantusi tribe, also known as Wantusi cattle. This left over right here. Look at this giraffe's tongue. You can actually tell it's blue in color. Because they spend most of their day eating, it kind of acts like a sunscreen to protect them while they eat. 18 inches. It's actually so long, in fact, they could lick their own eyeballs. Right over here. Now, right over 
rhinos do have really poor eyesight and often start running into each other. So a group of rhinos is known as a crash. So we're going to go on the Navi River journey in Pandora land. It looks like it's about a 30 minute wait. This is a really fun ride. I'm excited. Well, the park is almost closed now, but I'm going to have one last look at Dino Land before heading out. Oh man, we miss you finding Nemo the musical. No show times. This is such a fun land. I hope they never change it. Here's where they have the dinosaur ride. This is another staple. If you visit the Animal Kingdom, this ride is so fun. It's a classic. So definitely don't miss this. Well, I didn't make it onto this ride this trip, but I guess that just gives me a reason to come back, right? <laughs> All right, guys, the park is now closed, which means we have reached the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed following me along on my Animal Kingdom adventure. If you liked my video, go ahead and subscribe to my channel, or you can also follow me along on more adventures on Instagram at Disney with Lindsay. Again, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope it was fun and informative, and I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much. See you later.